Good morning, good morning, good morning, my good, good people. I know I've been MIA, we got a lot of moving parts, a lot of stuff going on. We got the coronavirus, we got people, you know, health scare, trying to get more information. People don't know when they get the chance to work from home or not. So if I get a chance to work from home, then I will give you guys better content, try to get stuff in better in order. We got the Who Has the Heat coming up next week. Shout out to the home team. 6313 Retro Queen McFly KOL PM Kicks Also check out the people on my featured channel list Jonah Foss Melanie Sweden T.R. Natty Ashley Reviews Pam M And the home team Now a lot of people say I got um, I always give it but I got a feeling This is going to be my first And thumbs down so just a real thing, yep, check on your loved ones, your kapuna, like you said, your your grandparents, things of that nature, because this corona thing is real serious in the field. I'm not the most superstitious person, but I believe in karma, i.e. look at Rudy Gobert, right? He was joking around, and look, karma has a way of visiting you back, whether it's directly or indirectly. So I got kids and all that stuff, so I don't want to be playing around, I just need to take the necessary precaution. Now, like I said, people are like, you giving this a thumbs down? Why? Why even buy the shoe? Because I don't want nobody to make the same mistake I made. These suckers are on sale for $150. I use a gift certificate, $50 gift certificate, and oh, by the way, upon further review, the Flex app is a farce. It's a ripoff. You can only get your gift certificates one per every 30 days and that is a bunch of crap all the other that rewards on that is all crappy the head start don't apply to hawaii so the only thing that's worth getting on that whole thing is the gift card don't waste your money getting the ten dollars because it's, it's better to get the 20 or 50 just be patient that's just my two cents other than that i got the biggie funko pop i think that was all right but other than that the only thing that's worth getting is the $20 and the $50 gift card. But if you get enough points, the best bang for the buck by far is the $50 gift card, in my opinion. So that's E's opinion, two times for today. Now, let's jump into this review. Enough talking. Now, no intro, no outro. We're going to get into it. Probably the only good thing about this box, this done shoe, is the box and the presentation. I tried to find 50 million ways to like this shoe. Uh -uh. It ain't happening. As you can see, this is a PP, a personal pair, and these are out of here. All right. After this review, I'm not taking them back, keeping my point. They're going on StockX. I ain't, I ain't afraid to keep it a buck with y'all. That's just the way it is, right? This is an Air Jordan 13 Retro Chinese New Year. Suggested retail price $200. They should have been $20. Um, the colorway pale ivory black digital pink size 10 you see you got your QR code RF code these are a quick strike so can you get military discount on this definitely a no no but like I said your presentation is good on this no stamp or ramp you got all these loops repping these Chinese media on the paper like so if you still decide this may I mean this is just my opinion don't let me try to steal you on if you want the shoe you want to wait for it to get a little bit cheaper by all means knock yourself out and blam they're just a sorry blam some of you may like the 13s right it's supposed to be resemble after a panther as you can see there's no panther looks in these joints as of right now i mean the d is definitely really really different and a very very unique shoe maybe somebody can pull it off if you got a small foot you probably can you can see the resemblance of the 13 right tinker half issue you got the the panther paw prints you also got the traditional um shank plate right here or the carbon fiber whatever you do then you got the panther eyeball the higher you can see that not bad the hologram but this gum pinky pink starburst looking whatever this is is just not cutting the mustard for me at all then right here I think he's, I don't know what this metal is, this new buck, rough buck, tough buck, whatever this is, but nope. Behind Jordan, you always got your Roman numeral 
13 like they're like so you got your laces nothing spectacular on this year's chinese on uh, new year's you just like the 34s you have this logo up here the half and black and white logo where you would normally have the whiskers you got the circles right here you can see you got a little bit of glue and as you can see it's all black so that's another no-go right in there for 200 dollars and it's a quick strike then right here you got this nice this is pretty decent right here and the outsole here and here is the eyeball of the panther right see the hologram supposed to see the 23 as you can see some people like to leave this piece on as i always do turn around on the back this is pretty good this material is here like so then you turn around here on the media side pretty much the same thing you have the chinese new year pattern definitely last year's chinese new year 12 which i still got to go back and get is by far way better than this and some of the other previous ones are better than this as you can see all along here look at that, that black line all that sloppy glue no go november golf on these joints just ain't cutting it then if you want to know if you got a legit pair you also got your 4d qr code which you can run it and you can see the date for this is 7 19 19 to 10 16 19 for the production date and inside you got that hot pink as well just like the box they feel pretty comfortable on feet and as you can see the shoe tree is 10 to 10 and a half so just pretty much another quick round look like i said you just you just see the the glue you can see it here and you see it here it just uh you got it here on the back you can just see all the black glue it just ain't cutting the jordan brand you definitely got to step this up ain't no back booty stroke on this at all i don't know what kind of materials but you definitely have to crepe it or whatever you want to use rejuvenator they got to protect it because i just don't know but like i said some of you making pull this off but this is not my cup of tea not only a little bit meat i gotta be honest i tried it on for comfort wise and stuff like that the shoe is pretty comfy but execution wise price point thumbs down so with that being said on the meter i give this about a 4.0 out of five yeah 4.0 out of five that's probably my lowest rating of any shoe like i said the price point still too high i don't even know if this shoe will be worth 75 dollars it just depends on what your collection like maybe you like this shoe maybe you don't but again that is my opinion you can let me know in the comment suggestion below do you agree do you disagree like i said the only two things about this that's really good is the box which is different than the traditional box and the presentation paper inside as we get to move along our way to 10k tell a family member friend comment like subscribe check out my fam check out my feature channel e-money shoes i'm out peace